a huge meteor that's about to hit the Earth. Hey, get off your phone. You're supposed to be helping me get all the ladies. Oh, my bad. Well, what about her? Oh, easy. All you gotta do is go up to her and say, <clears throat> Bonjour, little lady. She'll fall in love instantly. Um, if, if you think that'll work. Uh, uh, b b b bonjour, little lady. Ew, gross, go away. Oh, no, 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 no. You did it all wrong. Watch me do it. Bonjour, little lady. What? It didn't work at all when I tried it. I guess all the ladies just like you better. You know what they call me? Billionaire playboy really good with ladies, Aaron. <sighs> you know, it's probably because you're such a chubster. I heard all the ladies love it when guys aren't such lardos. Boy, I do sure hate lardos. The ladies will never love me. I mean, it's, it's more to love, yeah? I too was once as plump as you. So elephantine that I could barely stand up. But then I developed a system that saved me from that chunky lifestyle. I call it, by gut. Say what? What is it? It's a three-step strategy that will help you lose all those extra pounds. You're qualified to teach this stuff? <laughs> I guess the proof is in the pudding. When do we start? This exercise will prepare your mind and body for your imminent transformation. You will be led by a man greatly honored in his community. His name is Bob. <laughs> Um, 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 meditation is painful in the beginning, but instills immortal bliss and supreme joy in the end. <laughs> you were serious? I thought you were just clowning. <sighs> Six more months. Um, fold your legs tighter, make them like mine. You must make your legs tighter to enter a proper meditative state. Okay. A little tighter. Ugh. Tighter. I'm trying. That's as tight as I can go. Oh, oh. Whoops. Ugh. It seems as though meditation may be too much for you. Time to move on to our next exercise. Just as meditation nourishes the mind, so food nourishes the body. For this next exercise, you will be chewing some rice. Ooh, this is gonna be easy. Do you have any spoons? We do not use spoons in this class. How am I supposed to eat rice with this? Just do as I do. Our session will soon be ending. Once this hourglass runs out, our class is finished. We must pick up a piece of rice and eat it before them. I'm trying to grab it. I'm too small. Like this. This looks so easy. You will get it soon enough. You must keep in mind that clarity precedes success. <laughs> what? How dare you use hands to eat rice in my class? I'm hungry. And I'm tired of doing this. I would apologize for failing you, but I'm not sorry I have a problem. There is no such thing as failure, only results. Get out of my dojo. It's open. That was completely useless. He had me eat rice with chopsticks. That was I just already had enough of his shenanigans. But then chopsticks? Why chopsticks? 
Yeah, but that was just even. the... What were you saying? That was just the first step of the process. We still have two more steps to work through. You can't expect to have a full transformation overnight. What's next? A carpet of orange dresses the ground. As the trees grow bare, leaves flutter the ground. A nip in the air tells of stark days to come. But listen near, the fall isn't come. Who would like to follow? <laughs> Go right ahead, dear. Roses are red. Violets are blue. I really like to look at that blue. Wow, that was such a beautiful poem. Aaron, are you ready to speak now? Um, I, I think so. Go right ahead. Good luck following that one. I, uh, I think you missed the spot. There once was a man named Aaron. His lady skills, no comparing. He also had so much money and made all the ladies come running. So rich, so fine, so many dimes. If you see all the ladies staring, you can bet that they've seen Aaron. Thank you. Well, wasn't that just charming? Eh? No. No, it wasn't. Well, if you think you're so talented, then why don't you go next? Let me see what you're made of. This better be good. Some, some days I felt somber that I was so fat. I thought there was nothing to do about that. But then I met Aaron, and he gave me hope. Maybe he can impede this, this slippy down slope. If his guidance succeeds, it shall impel my deflation, causing my fat to take an everlasting vacation. Yet in the process of forming my features, he's proved to be an incapable teacher. The chapters of his book are quite preposterous. The claims he made are, are awfully imposterous. First, he had me eating rice with chopsticks? What could be next in this book of tricks? Now, since my hope in him has utterly faded, I plan to continue this journey entirely unaided. Incapable teacher, book of tricks. What were you talking about back there? <sighs> Nothing you're having me do is helping me get all the ladies. What did I tell you before? It's a process, it takes time. The process isn't doing anything. Poems aren't gonna help any of this. You just need to give me more time. It's not gonna be instant. We haven't even done chapter three yet. I've given you more than enough time already. In all the things you've had me do, I've made zero progress. If your book worked, I would have noticed at least a small improvement by now. You just need to give me more time. Don't make me say it again. Forget more time. All I've wanted is to be as good with the ladies as you are. But I can't, okay? It just won't happen. I'm trying, but it just won't happen. I see what's going on here. You're just pee being jealous. I'll just figure it out on my own. I'm out of here. Oh, hey, uh, I'm Jared. What's going on, Bean Sprout? I is this the, the fitness class? You got a Bean Boy. My name is Aaron. I, I mean, I mean Eric. My name is Eric. Uh, now, can you do me a quick favor and sign this for me? Come on, Bean Soup, sign it already. All right, now that all the boring stuff is over, let's get started.
That was a good workout. I feel a thousand pounds lighter. I'm so proud of you, String Bean. Thank you so much. I feel so good. You're welcome, but I need to tell you something. Yeah, okay. What's that? I haven't been fully honest with you. What do you mean, Eric? <laughs> You've been great. Yeah, but that's not actually who I am. What? It was you, Aaron, the whole time? Yep. It turns out I am a capable teacher after all. What? This can't be possible. And yet it is. <sighs> I guess you're right. I'm sorry for what I said, Aaron. You've proved you can be a capable teacher. I think I'm ready to follow your instructions again. I'll listen to whatever you say. All right, you're a changed man. I think you can get her this time. Oh, I'm fit now. I wore my nicest clothes. <sighs> what should I say? You ready? Yeah. You're gonna go up to her and you're gonna say, you think I'm cute, you lose challenge. What does that mean? Do you want a demonstration? Uh, yeah, yes please. All right. Oh, oh. What? That's never gonna work. I am a capable teacher, remember? Oh, oh she's here. I think I'm just gonna be myself. Whatever they're listening uh, to whatever I say. I'm just gonna be myself. Well, how about that weather? What? Would you maybe want to do something sometime? Not, not, not like a date, but kind of just like hanging out, you know? Uh, you know, I, I, I won the Finkelbottom Catholic Forensic League second place novice duo interpretation award. In I, I, I have to say, I've never seen such natural radiance. Hey, uh, I, I gotta ask you something. Open Will you marry me? You sit in clothes. Let's go somewhere far away Cause if all I have is you Then I'll be just fine Maybe say, a little tiger? A little tiger. <laughs> Why? <laughs> it makes no sense. I, th I think that's... Rawr! <laughs> oh, I can't do it anymore! Jonah! Jonah! I'm done! It's done!